Monday. This is July 3rd, 2018. I am here working from home. Um, as I mentioned, um, I don't know if I did or not, but yes, past few days have been rough. Thank God for divine connections, like my good friend Charlene, who whenever you're feeling down in the spirit, you need people around you that's going to build you up, that's going to encourage you and pray when you can't pray. So yesterday was one of those days I was so discouraged because DJ told me that he got noticed that he was going to be, you know, going to Kuwait. And it's crazy because I know what the father told me. And, you know, a part of me is like, okay, maybe that's it. That's because he got official notice from the government. But, you know, I still am holding on to his word that DJ is not leaving to get deployed. And so I am still believing in that, and that's what I'm going to hold on to. And today the Lord has been really speaking to me about truly resting in his promises and resting in his faithfulness. The Father has been really talking to me about how he has everything under control. And then all of my worries, my anxieties, my fears, everything that, that has been stressing me out, the Lord has already taken care of it. And so here I am just continuing to believe God, continuing to focus on His faithfulness, focus on His promises, and doing what I need to do to prepare for whatever it is, this new assignment, this new um, um, time in my life, this new season, where I'm going to believe God that no matter what's going on in my situation, I'm going to choose to trust Him. And it's completely the opposite of what God showed me. Everything that's happening around me is going against what He showed me and what He promised me. And here I am holding on to that word and to His faithfulness, knowing that He will complete it and that the angels are fighting for me. And so I'm just going to rest in that, rest in knowing that God has everything taken care of. And so I just wanted to um, just come on here real quickly and kind of share what's been in my heart and to encourage you all that, yes, you're going to have your low days, but you're also going to have your high days. And maybe you have those days where you don't really know what you're feeling. Um, and that's where I'm at right now. I'm kind of numb, if that makes sense. I'm pretty numb with everything that's going on. But I'm going to choose joy. I'm going to choose faith. I'm going to choose strength. I'm going to choose peace that passes all understanding. And most importantly, I'm going to choose Jesus because I know Jesus is a man that should not, doesn't lie, not a man that should lie, nor a son of man that should repent. And I'm holding on to his word. I'm holding on to his faithfulness. And most importantly, I'm holding on with every ounce of my being because everything in me wants to give up. But I just can't. All I can do is lay down in his arms, lay down in his presence and say, Father, have your way. All right, God bless you guys, and I'll talk to you all soon. Have a great day.